Oh, catnip. I wish I could stay here all the time, but then the air could go to my house. That'd be even better. Oh, that's, that's, that's cat. That's just like that Freaky Friday. You got to think ahead to do something like that. Say, listen. Ah, uh, filming live from a third story one bedroom apartment in North Mishawak, Indiana, the Princess City, cursed by geese. It's the Handlebar Growing Mustache Extravaganza with your host, Dave. Handlebar Mustache Show, Handlebar Mustache Show. Stash is looking great, but we can't be late for the Handlebar Mustache Show. Welcome back to your six day 101, take two. Congratulations, Grats. Ah, uh, Fat, is that you? Oh, Slim, I heard about the big trip up north with the niece with the big honors. Yeah, yeah, my oldest niece just graduated from the high school. So she's off to a, I think she's going to be an art history major with, like, forensic leanings. So we'll see about that. But she'll be upstate New York. So she's uh, getting the dodge out of hell. Not upstate in the hookah. Oh, that's good. Yeah, not the Hooskow. Not that upstate. <laughs> That'd be bad. Uh, what prison do you want to be? Yeah, I might as well make it upstate New York. My neighborhood, when they say upstate, we get nervous. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that's because you grew up with a bunch of hoodlums. I know. <laughs> so, anyway, we got to go to Franny's church tomorrow. They have the kids from the uh, Vacation Bible School putting on their big presentation. So that could be fun. We'll see. Be one of those guys. I was an Awana leader, me and Erica, for a while. We had these kids, and well, it wasn't like vacation Bible school, but we were like, it was Awana. Like every Wednesday night, the kids would come, and we would talk about God and stuff. So it was yeah. a lot of fun. Yeah, I've started. Well, friend and I have started listening to Gregorian chants as we sleep. So, I think they might have some yeah, ancient wisdom. Cats. I think they're all in Latin. I want to tell Kylie, these cats, I was playing music earlier, they love it. They sleep and they're uh, calming down. Oh, yeah. Do they dance? Well, not yet, but I figure at least if it's calming, I think they like to hear the, the music. I think, I think a cat shuffle. would like to shuffle. Like maybe the Cuban shuffle? Hmm. Or the Harlem Shuffle? Or the Shuffly Shuffle Shuffle? The least likely of all shuffles? Shuffling crew. Shuffle on down. Doing it for you. Yeah, the we're Bears. So we know we're, we're so good with something like that. Either way. <laughs> yes. I'm a Packer fan. I don't even know that Super Bowl Shuffle. Let's go. The Super Bowl Shuffle. Yeah, That's there. right. Remember that? Oh, yeah. Yeah, the bear shuffling crew. My name is Dent. If you're too slow, you're going to get bent. That's right. That's right. There you go. I remember that guy. Richard Dent. He was a beast. 95 coming off the edge. Look out. I was always a big Otis Wilson fan. Ah, 55. Coming at your small direction. Outside linebacker. Yeah, yeah, because he played the same position I do. Yeah, yeah. Actually, I played oh, the str Marshall, that guy, the last guy you know, want to meet in a dark alley. Yeah, yeah. I played the I played the strong tough. side, so I was usually lined up over the tight end if they had one. And then Steve Lemmy was the weak side linebacker. He, which was in theory the funner job because you got to drop <laughs> back in the coverage. Uh, and let's see how the routes develop and see if he can catch somebody. Going yeah, the and them a big it depends whether it was too deep. Their chops. If it was too deep, then there were five zones uh, to cover, and if it was three deep, there was only four zones to cover. Uh, that's why I'm glad I played offense. I just had to make sure you guys didn't tackle me. Oh yeah, crazy legs, fat. That's what they called them. <laughs> I was pretty good. I was the best kid in eighth grade. I just didn't play much in high school, but uh, yeah, yeah, we were undefeated. I was the quarterback, the running back, and the kicker. The, I, well, the guy that kicked the extra points and oh, the field yeah. goals. 
We were we were undefeated my eighth grade year. Cool. We played like uh, Grissom and we played for Schmucker. We played Grissom and John Young and a couple of schools from Elkhart. Like Northside and Pierre Moran. Yeah, yeah. So we were super psyched. And then we got to be freshmen and we didn't play so good. Yeah, yeah, and then you mix in with all the other 12, 11, and 10th graders. And they just sit on your head and say, ha, take that, kid. No, no, it was, Penn was like 10, 11, and 12. So we oh, we ruled right. the roost when we were freshmen. Right. Okay. We were still in middle school as we were ninth graders. So we were like the big <laughs> thing on campus. Stuff and all the way they changed this stuff all the ways along. Yeah. Well, if you ever wonder why, it's probably for the money. That's my guess. Uh, uh, where's my, my? I got a new shirt here. from Franny Blackhawks. Looking nice. All right. Well, I probably said too much. Yeah, I don't think so. Just enough. Knock on wood. Keep it classy, in the web. And until I see you mañana, I mean lunes, I bid you all arrivederci and adieu. Adieu. Oh, that's going to be rough. Waking up two days in a row.